Uh, well, uh, we have been part of uh, Olympiad for last uh, 10 odd years. So, our all the students, 2,500 plus students participate in Olympiad and English, Maths and Science. So, uh, you know, it, it, it gives them a very good exposure. I mean, I represent uh, English department of the school. So, what, what I say, you know, Participating in Olympiad prepares them for uh, international, you know, uh, exposure. I mean, uh, a lot of students from Nepal, they prepare for abroad studies. So it helps them really well to crack uh, exams like GRE, IELTS, TOEFL and all these competency-based English testing exams. The, the sort of, uh, uh, you know, textbooks or the curriculum is there for, you know, the students prepared by CBSU or let's say local board. That does not really cater to the needs of the 21st century students. Uh, teachers put in a lot of efforts to prepare the uh, students because nowadays, you know, in the schools you have a lot of things like uh, co-curricular activities and extracurricular activities and then you have the pressure of, uh, you know, completing syllabus on time. So apart from these, if we go for any extra, you know, English testing or maths testing exams, that's always a challenge. So they have been doing a tremendous job. We have been part of this Olympiad for last uh, more than 10 years. It's, it's mandatory for all the students to have at least one international certificate. So we count this certificate as one international certificate. From Kathmandu, two, three other schools are also participating in Olympiad exams. Schools, if they have to grow, they have to give better exposure, international exposure to their students. Uh, either it be, you know, the language subjects or any other subject like science or maths. So, you know, they, they have to come out of their comfort zone and then take up challenges of, uh, you know, preparing their students for Olympiads and all.